Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be revealing what my big plan was that I told you about a couple of videos back. And if you haven't been able to tell already by the title, I am starting an Etsy shop. Now this Etsy shop is um, about guinea pigs. I'm going to be making like guinea pig um, like lap pads and things like that. I'm not going to be making full liners um, at the moment anyway. But I am going to be making quite a few different items for you guys to buy um, if you want to, if you have your own pigs. And I'm not going to be disclosing everything I'm doing uh, in this first video because I want it to kind of be like a journey and I want to sh like reveal like as we go along. And I want to keep some things a secret for now so not everything um, is going to be told to you like straight away in this one video. But I have just got my fleece order in. I have already got all the rest of my stuff. The last thing to come was the fleece order from Joann's. Um, which is a fleece company in America. I live in the UK, so um, it had to be shipped over and everything over here. But my order is right here beside me in this like a big box. So I'm going to like put it in front here now and open it and show you some of the patterns that I have. I'm not going to show you them all yet, but then afterwards I'm going to talk to you a bit about um, what I'm going to be doing, when the shop's going to open, things like that. Okay, so I've got my box here. It's absolutely huge. I ordered 18 yards of fleece. So I'm going to open it up and find some of the ones I'm going to show you guys. Okay, so I have seven different fleeces and they're all going to be available for you guys um, once I put them on my shop and everything. However, I am going to be making my own liners as well for my guinea pig's cage out of two of the different fleeces. So I'm going to do one on one side and one on the other side. So those are the fleeces I'm going to show you. I might show you one more because um, there's so many here and they look really exciting but I'm not going to show you them all yet because I want some surprises. Um, so I'm going to show you the two that I have for my own cage first and then I'll pick another one that I want to show you guys. So the first fleece that I have, this was my absolute favourite fleece and I really want it for my cage, is this bee themed fleece and I'm so obsessed. This is so soft as well. But this is a bee fleece. Um, I've got four yards of this one. Um, so I've got two yards for myself that I'm going to make my liners out of. And then two yards um, to make items out of uh, for my Etsy shop. And I really like this fleece. It's really soft. I think most of my fleeces are blizzard fleeces. Um, so they should wick quite well, hopefully. But yeah, I'm going to be making one side of my liners out of this and then one side out of this fleece. So this is like a mint coloured with rainbow and clouds fleece. It's so bright on that. Um, but yeah, I love this fleece as well. It's absolutely adorable. And I really like this fleece as well. I'm going to know in a bit about which was the second fleece I wanted for my own cage. But in the end, I picked this one. I think it was really nice and colourful. And I can do like some of my hides that kind of block colours um, with this really nice. Like I have this pink cube from Beastie Beds um, that I think will match the pink on this quite nice, on the like rainbow quite nicely. So those are the two that I'm using for myself as well as um, are going to be available for you guys on my Etsy shop. And then for the rest of my fleeces, I got them in two yards, um, so two yards to make all my stuff out of. And for those people that really like more neutral colours, I got this plaid print um, that's like grey with like a little bit of beige running through it. I thought it looked really quite sophisticated, very nice. My sister was obsessed with this one, she thought it looked like really posh and everything. I thought this was quite nice for like a more neutral style cage, because um, I know some people have them in their like living room or their dining room and don't want them really bright colours. So I got this for more of a neutral colour. And it's also really nice and pretty as well. It's also really versatile if you want to pair lots of different hideys with it. So I thought this was a really nice fleece as well. So those are the fleeces I'm going to show you for now. I have four other patterns and those contain things with like floral patterns, things that are like more neutral like this one, things that are more bright like this one, um, some that are more just plain um, but like still bright colours and they've got animals and there's all sorts of different patterns still to come for you guys to see. I'm also obsessed with the quality of this fleece. The colours are so vibrant, the fleece looks soft, it feels soft. And it really is amazing. Um, this fleece is from Joann's. If anyone would like to go, um, you know, have a look. And if in the future I do do like custom orders, 
um, that will be where I get my fleece from so in the future if um, I do custom orders then you'll have to look on there for the fleeces. I have such a good range of different fleeces and I mean this bee print I saw it and I was like I have to have this for myself and put my shop. I think this was kind of the fleece that inspired the whole thing because I absolutely love it. I've been obsessed with yellow so this fleece was just perfect. Going forward with my channel, um, I'm going to be doing some more of this business content and things like that. So I hope you guys don't mind that. Um, I think there's, I think it should be quite good. I will be doing videos on me making my own liners and making some of the items, not every single one. I've got like over 100 items to make. So I'm probably not going to show like 100 items making the same thing. It will be quite repetitive. But I will be showing some of it like in time lapses, um, during like vlogs or different videos and things like that. I'm also hoping to do a video once I kind of like upload all my items to my shop and you guys can buy them of me like packaging orders and things like that. Um, I won't be like showing like, obviously anyone's addresses or anything like that. It'll all be just, oh, here's the items that I'm packaging. This is what someone ordered, kind of things like that. And I think that'll be quite cool content for you guys to see. And as well as the fact that I am obviously offering these items for sale now, I'm really hoping that some of you guys um, buy them. Obviously, if you don't, that is absolutely fine. Some of you might not even have guinea pigs. I know not everyone's going to have guinea pigs and not everyone's going to want these items. But I just thought for some of you guys that do, um, it'd be really cool to like show you guys that. And even if you don't want the items, you can at least see like some of the stuff about how I make them and me packaging them. Because I love watching packaging videos. I think it's quite cool. So. so yeah, I hope you guys are excited for this. I really am. I've got everything else that I need now. I've got like all my postal bags. I've got this massive thing of U-Haul over here. And my U-Haul that I ordered is so much thicker than everyone's U-Haul that I've seen on videos in the past. Everyone's is like quite thin. And mine is like a proper blanket. It's like thick as anything. It's like thicker than this fleece, like definitely. It's like so thick. So I don't even know how many like pieces of that I'm gonna use yet. I thought I was gonna do like a double U-Haul in the middle. But I think I'm just gonna have to see like how thick it is and how it works and stuff. But I'm gonna be doing like testers and everything first before I um like send make like the items for you guys to buy therefore like hopefully the items will be the best quality they can possibly be and i'm going to really try and make them really really nice uh, this fleece is brilliant though so that should hopefully help me <laughs> Thank you. 